What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. For those that don't know, my name is Josh Moore and I'm a photographer from Northeast Tennessee. I got something cool today guys. I found this at Target. It is the new. And by new I mean, okay, they slightly upgraded it and changed the color. Polaroid Now Plus Edition 2. Yeah. Or Generation 2. My bad. I'm hoping they fix the light meter on this thing because the now plus I have up here, the black one, that light meter is so jacked up, man. It is not, not good. I'm hoping that this one is fixed and, you know, ready to go. Whole nine yards, I am. Because the app is really cool. I love to do a bunch of really long night, night shots along the parkway or in the Smokies, you know, with this. So that's the hope. But yeah, let's show off the box. I picked this up today. I do like the color, um, the new green. Somebody is a big fan of Master Chief because that is Master Chief green, I hate to tell you. And it would be cool to get some film that color too, to be honest with you. But here, I'm just gonna show off the box real quick because this is an unboxing video. We're gonna unbox it. And I am taking this with me this weekend to the Smokies to test out. So really, really hoping to get some cool shots with this thing. You know all right so there we've seen the box see the seals are still sealed i just picked it up at target this box set was 149 at target and yeah is there any on the bottom nope. okay save my box out my boxes so got a nice cool little polaroid image on the front i do like the packaging they did a really good job on the packaging I'm a fan of that. Oh, here we get a little color inside. All right. So that's the first thing we see when you open up. Hello, let's start creating. And then you see they folded this up and you've got your full set of instructions on how to use the thing. Little poster. And your instructions, which if you're watching my channel, you know how to use a Polaroid camera probably. If you don't, well, it's pretty easy. You load the film. This one, this one though, you do have to turn the flash on and off a certain way and all that. We'll get into that. But for the most part, guys, pretty self-explanatory. Oh, they give you a little green wristlet. I like that. The other Now Plus didn't come with this. This is cool. So... Nice little green clasp. It's like really sealed. <laughs> that little rubber thing's no joke. Good Lord. There we go. Hey, I like that. That is probably what I'll use actually. I had pulled my orange strap off to put on it because usually they give you a little dinky strap, but no, I like this. This, this one we'll use. I do like that. That is nice. That is a nice addition. I like that. Good job. Polaroid. The big thing, the big change, the most noticeable change, other than the color, is the new plug on the end. They now take the standard USB-C. So here is your new ends. That is the most notable change. Oh man. I love that green color. I'm gonna be honest with you, I probably would have bought this um, just because of the color. And I like to collect things, so that don't help either, does it? <laughs> all right, so here's the filter set that came with all the other Now Plus that we had. We'll pull these out and go over them again. Let's see. All righty. A nice lens cap it gives you. I love the lens cap. Um, here's a nice orange filter. See here? Woo! You can see my hand back there, orange. Really nice filter. I like using the yellow and red filters on black and white film. Pull some contrast. But here's the red. Let's see. 
Here's the yellow. And these, these are easy, they just pop right on. They just, boop, you push it right on. Just like that, there's the blue. You can see right there, blue. And this should be, yeah, the little, you can see the little, it makes like these little bursts, little sunbursts filter. That's a cool filter to have. Especially if you've got a lot of like light sources. Just some really cool stuff. Let me move all that to the side. See, there's that it in there. Oh, this one didn't come with no film. Sad time. Good thing I've got some packs. <laughs> but let's see. The big reveal. I like, I'm liking the color so far from through the Through the plastic. Oh man. Now that is cool color. Look at this guys. This is nice. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. That is Master Chief Green too by the way. That is that is what we'll call it too, Master Chief Green. I do like that. That is sharp. And then put your little wrist strap on it. You got an all green machine. That is nice. I hope to test this out this weekend. So there'll be a follow up video with this um, on testing it. So for those of you that are curious about the filters, it goes on like the lens cap. It just pushes right on like that. That's all you have to do. Right here is your Wi-Fi button. You will push that and link it to your phone, pull up the app, it'll sync up, and you can do your exposures and all that stuff. On the bottom, we have a nice little tripod mount. This should honestly become standard. This is such a simple little feature that this should just be on all Polaroids. This shouldn't be something like super exclusive to the Nail Plus, um, just because it's so easy. <laughs> It's just like the most common feature ever. So like, I don't know why they just put it on the Now Plus. That should just be on all of them, in my opinion. But I do like it. I wish, I was talking in the, the feed on, um, on the channel here and we were talking about, you know, some stuff we wish Polaroid would do. And the one thing I brought up was like, I wish they would remake the SX-70 and make some new models of that why not go for it and i guarantee you it would sell out 250 dollars price tag uh, that is in premium glass the whole nine yards that would be nice taking eye top film come on guys polaroid make it happen that would be awesome but yeah loving this can't wait to use it this weekend you have your power button on the back so you'll power it on right here. No shots are in it. So you see the flash, there's no film in it, but if there was film in this, the flash would be solid. You would just push it once to turn the flash off. See, the flash goes away, so there's no longer a flash. And then on the front, you'll push that to sync, and that'll turn, that'll flash blue when it's synced up. Yeah, and then you'll have your, your counter here for your film. And then on the front, you've got your red button. Man, they should have done that button a different color. Red button, red and green, red and green just, uh, they could have done black, black button there would have been cool. But yeah, this is, this is nice, I like it. I'm excited to use it. I was excited to use the original now plus but it kept blowing out all the images <laughs> and then i got mad because i wasted like 100 bucks in film <laughs> and then after some time i went and bought the older models and the exposures were perfect so the now and now plus the first gen i'm not a fan of they are they are a money pit i think what they need to do is just be like hey guys we messed it up our bad 
here's a firmware update, plug it in, update it and fix it. That's probably all they did here was probably a firmware update to fix the light meter is what I'm hoping. So we'll see, I'm excited to use it. That's the unboxing, that's everything that came with it. So yeah, keep an eye out for the next video. We're gonna go test this out in the Smokies. I'm gonna do some night shots while I'm in the Smokies too this weekend, the, the Liliad or whatever media shower is going on. So hopefully I can do some night photography while I'm here this weekend, that'd be nice. I'm gonna plan a trip too coming up, uh, going to Roan Mountain and doing some night shots along the Appalachian Trail up there. Really dark, perfect dark sky event, dark sky area. I mean, just stars for days, it's amazing. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go up there soon, find a good azalea bush or a rhododendron bloom and try to do some good night shots. I'm excited for that. That'll be coming up soon. I'm hoping that this exposure is working better. And if it is, this will be the camera I will take with me to Disney and do some Disney shots with because the long exposure feature would be great for fireworks. So we'll see. I'm excited for that Disney trip too. That's gonna be so much fun. But yeah, hope you all like this video. Quick unboxing, let you know everything you, you get with it. This is a cool feature. This is cool. This is much better than dopey little cheap crap they give you. I like this. That's nice. Alrighty guys, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Working my way up to 500, almost there. Getting right there guys, so close. So close, free for you to do so. Just subscribe, hit that sub. Put out videos every week. Um, we do landscape photography, portrait photography. We do film, we do Polaroids. We do street, we do concerts. We do kind of a little bit of everything. If I like it, I shoot it. That's just what I do. I ordered some new canvas prints for the studio too. I'm gonna to have a, a video coming out on my canvas prints that I do because I actually print some of the largest canvas prints in the world uh, for purchase. So they're pretty cool. Uh, the biggest canvas made print, all in one print, no stitching, no nothing, it's 10 feet long. And I think it's three and a half feet wide that I've done, but I do um, murals too, you know, where they, go into an office building and you see this big long stretch of uh, photos. I do those too. So my biggest one is 25 feet long by 10 feet tall, 10 and a half feet tall. Yeah. So I've got a bunch of prints coming in from a client um, that ordered some for their new hospital. And we are going to check them out too. There are gonna be, there's some big prints in there. I, there's a couple of nine footers in there. So it'd be perfect to show off. These things come so ridiculously packaged. I had them come one time. They were so packaged so well that my buddy John made a chicken coop <laughs> out of the packaging. It was, you know, lumber. They had boxed everything in crazy. It came on a 18 wheeler. But uh, yeah, we're gonna show some of those off too. I got a couple of nice big prints. Probably gonna put one big one right here. Replace the Modest Mouse, my favorite band poster. And I'll probably move that across the studio. But uh, I've got some really nice canvas prints I'm going to put back here. Yeah, dress it up a little bit. So keep an eye out for all of that. But thanks for watching, guys. I greatly appreciate you. Um, again, don't forget to subscribe. And we'll catch you next time, guys. Later. Okay, so I just opened this pack of film to put inside the new camera. And it didn't come with a seal inside. Like it wasn't sealed at all. It was just thrown in there. What the heck? Okay, I hope it feels light. Like it don't feel like it's a full pack either. So I don't know. Okay, so it had no film in it and it had trouble ejecting. What the hell? All right, so I ended up taking that film back to Walmart and they did take it back. They said that they've had a couple that way um, and they gave me my money back. So I went back there and bought two more, made sure to fill them that they were heavy and they were good. I put one pack in and we're good to go now, but that was crazy. They Walmart did say though, 
my Walmart anyways, that they have gotten a few that way. And they don't know if it's been returned. Somebody's taken it out and done it and returned it, or if it just came from the factory that way. But they have had a couple others turned in the same way. So I just wanted to share that.